Welcome to the Cocktail Class! We have our beautiful and talented studio audience with us here. And uh, this, of course, is part of our wild Tiki Summer. We have so many great events happening all summer long. Watch all of our channels, the Take Five Guys, the Dustin Curry, and of course, you're right here on Dalt McLean. Today, it's kind of a red theme. Uh, we're going to start with a great classic, the Bloody Mary. Great kind of tiki drink for the summer. Parting shot, uh, we've got kind of a cherry pop bomb that we're going to be uh, taking a little bit of here. It's going to be a lot of fun. So let's get started with the Bloody Mary. First, into your pitcher. Now, we're doing several of these. We're going to do a pitcher of Bloody Marys. You have uh, a six packs of these six fluid ounce uh, warm tomato drink. This particular brand that's called Snappy Tom. Okay. So it's kind of a tomato vegetable juice like V8, but it's on the warm side. It's okay. got spices already in it. Okay. So that is in there. Okay. Next, we ounce. add eight ounces of vodka. Ooh. Yes, here we go. Yes, Kaka. Sterilize your medical instruments. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> for whatever procedures you may be performing. <laughs> Sorry about that. That little, that little infection which turned up. thoroughly. It still burns when I pee. Sad, really. We have to add uh, two dashes per drink. So for that means it's gonna be 10 dashes of Worcestershire. 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 Worcestershire sauce. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Bloody Mary. I like to try to have one of these once a month. And it's bad for you if I don't. I was, I was reaching. Nick, yes. hold up the glass. So you can see that we have salted the rim of our glass. While suddenly when we come back, magically he's going to hold it up and they're all going to have ice in it. And now, bing! And now they have ice in them. That's awesome. So each glass, of course, has ice. We've salted the rim by, of course, squeezing lime around it, dipping it in some um, some sea salt or uh, some margarita salt, and then we have garnished with a piece of celery stock in each glass. We're also going to eventually garnish with uh, a stuffed olive right there in each glass. For each one, you have to do just a crack of pepper and crack. garnish with an olive. Okay. Now we can give that to the studio audience. Uh, Del, I, I told Del earlier I've never had a Bloody Mary, so. And I was telling him that Bloody Marys are traditionally sort of an, an eye-opener drink. It's a, it's a it's something that takes the edge off a hangover in the morning. Bloody Marys, let's give them a taste. Here we go. That's good. It's kind of like vodka soup. <laughs> you can see it all over his face. Now give it another sip. Come on. Definitely get the spicy snappy tom. Definitely get the Worcestershire. The salt is really good to tingle it up. What are you thinking there, bud? What do you think, bud? Interesting. <laughs> and the vote from our studio audience? Yeah! All right, well, good job. Okay, it's time for party shot. Yeah! And our party shot today is called a cherry pop. It is equal parts of, in this case, one ounce per serving, five ounces of, because I have Southern Comfort. I can't okay. wait to pop my cherry. Yes. yes. <laughs> Five ounces of amaretto. I can smell that from here. You can take a rust off a bumper. Yes. And uh, a little less than five ounces of grenadine. That's, that's all. Fill the shaker with ice. Got equal parts of each in here. And we're going to give it a shake. Shake, 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 shake. This is kind of what she looks like. <coughs> now, it's a red theme tonight. A Bloody Mary and a pop cherry. And a pop cherry. Yeah, that's the way it goes. Parting shots. Here we go, everyone. Uh, that goes all smooth. Not bad. It's, it's kind of tastes a little bit it's like cough syrup. A little cough syrupy. A little bit. It's the cherry. It's the cherry. 
good. Very good. All right, party shot, here it is. As you know, if you've got a recipe, put it in the comments below. Maybe you could join us here on Cocktail Class. Please hit the like button down below. Be sure to thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you later. Bye! Woo!